Hi there, Rolly, Z01BKD. I've had several questions lately uh, asked me to explain what, how to tune an antenna. Do I cut some off to make it resonant or do I add some on to the antenna to make it resonant? And I thought, what better than to have a look at a piano and, and sort of describe it a little bit. We could start off with, a, a, say, a middle C here, like that. And then we have a harmonic relation to that. Like that. We could almost say that was, uh, let's see, uh, 80, 40, 20, 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 160. <laughs> and so we have a harmonic relationship uh, here. And we go, well, how does that uh, work? When we have a look inside the piano, there we have long strings, which are, uh, are these notes from down here. Then we have a lot of short strings up over here, which are these notes up here. So let's say, that, um, uh, let's say we start at the 80 metre, what we, what we term, we'll, we'll term the 80 metre uh, uh, frequency. Middle C here, we'll call that 80 metre, shall we? And we actually have our antenna tuned a little bit high, somewhere up, uh, up here like this. And, and if I can sh lengthen it, Great, we got it exactly on resonance. All we've done is lengthen the string. Likewise, if we're a little bit low in frequency, we want to get to, we want to get to here a little bit low in frequency. Beautiful on resonance. And so we have the harmonic relationship between 80, 40, 20, and 10. And so where does 15 fit into that? Well, 15 is a harmonic of uh, uh, 40 meters. So, there's our relationship there. There's our harmonic for, from 40. Of course, if we put that in with our, our, our first lot, and we put that in there, Sounds a little bit discordant, doesn't it? And, it? and it is. But 40 and 15, 40 and, 50 and 15 are related. Great, so now we can get some sort of appreciation that if we're high in frequency uh, to where we want to be, high, there's where we want to be, high, make it lower. If we're low, Here's where we want to be, make it higher. So we just by altering the length of the string so we can alter the, our frequency. And that gives a, a direct relationship. What do we do in amateur radio? If we're low in, the, in frequency to where we want to be, then cut a bit off. Just cut a little bit off until we get onto resonance. And finally, you'll make beautiful music.